Round 1 highlights from the NEC Series Latino America Tours Roberto De Vicenzo Invitational held in Uruguay starting off on the fifth hole where there were a ton of eagles on Thursday. It's Tyler McCumber, that last name may sound familiar to you. He's the son of 10-time PGA Tour champion Mark McCumber, sitting at one over at this point, but absolutely stuffs his second shot in there on the par five. This for Eagle to get to one under par into red numbers. McCumber gets it to drop. He would finish at two under overall after 18 holes. And he wins, by the way, for the best beard on the NEC series thus far. Over now to the 14th, it's Rodolfo Casabon sitting at one under. This from the greenside bunker. Doesn't do what he thought it was going to do. Nope, it's not going to turn, so he leaves himself there with about six feet for birdie to get to two under par. Casabon would go on to birdie 16 and 17 as well to come in at four under on Thursday. He's just three off the lead. Mitchell Gregson now on the eighth. Looking for a strong finish. He has one top 20 on the season, but he's playing on conditional status, so a big finish this week would do wonders as he drops one from birdie bomb distance to reach five under. He would finish his day at four under overall. Gato Zarlanga now from Argentina. This for a short eagle to jump to seven under par. I told you there were a ton of eagles. He dropped only one shot on the day for a tidy 65. Good enough for a share of the lead at seven under. Staying on the fifth, it's Austin Graham. Graham is hailing from California. This is his second year playing on the Latino America Tour. I wasn't kidding when I said we saw a lot of eagles on Thursday on the fifth. That was his second shot, leaving himself a pretty straightforward look at eagle here to get to seven under par, which is where he would finish. He's also in a tie for that top spot. Play was called, by the way, due to darkness, so those that did not complete their first rounds on Thursday will do so beginning at 8 a.m. Friday morning. Staying with Austin Graham on the 8th, sitting at 7 under at this point. He would nuzzle that one up pretty close, tap it in, but again would just finish at 7 under par. Over now to the man they call Puma Dominguez. His real name is Emilio, but let's be honest, Puma is a way cooler nickname. This is his shot out of the greenside bunker on the 8th. And for birdie here to get to 7 under and Join a share of the lead with a 65. You had a tie for fourth last week's trying to roll that momentum into a win.